When we talk about squatting, you have two basic stances. One is commonly referred to as a powerlifting stance. Another one is commonly called the Olympic lifting stance. The difference being, not that you only use those in those sports, but it tends to be more common in them. With Olympic lifters, because of the snatch and the clean and jerk, you tend to have a much more narrow stance with your feet and a high bar position up on top of the traps. Not the cervical spine, but on the traps. With powerlifting, you tend to see, not always, but much more common, a wider foot position and a lower bar position, almost resting on the rear delts, making a little shelf back there for it. Because of the differences in the sports, those are just some differences in the stances that you most commonly see. What they end up looking like is, I'm going to show you from the back view and then kind of what the side happens. In the high bar stance, we're going to see this type of position. Neither one is better than the other. They have different focuses, focus eye on the legs. The more narrow stance is going to hit the tend to hit the quads a little bit more. The wider stance, because of the position, when you go out wide and the bar being lower, you will actually sit back into the hips, have a more vertical shin angle. So, wide stance. Lower bar, sitting back into it, still hitting parallel, but much more vertical shins as compared to high bar, more vertical torso, more translation of the shins, and more quad emphasis, which would look similar. Look that. More forward translation of the knees, a little bit more vertical in the torso, you're not leaning as far forward, not sitting into the hips as much. So, if I'm a power lifter, I want to find the best stance to lift the most weight. Typically more of the power lifting stance. If I'm an Olympic lifter, I want it to simulate what I'm really going to have to do at the bottom of that clean and stand up. You can't do that in a power lifting stance. The bar is literally in front of you, it won't work. So you want to get strong in those positions. That high bar, closer stance, by keeping the torso more upright, you have to do a little bit of a different kind of job in not folding forward. So you sit in that same Olympic style stance. Some power lifters have a narrow high bar squat, and they're great at it. Some power lifters go super, super wide. Some have more moderate. You have to find what works best for you, but that's just a quick breakdown the difference between those two when you hear an Oli squat, a powerlifting squat. There's a lot of variations between based on people, how their hips are built, where their femurs sit, what their goals are is going to change a lot of that as well. I'm a powerlifter. I have a pretty moderately wide stance. I do a lot of close stance high bar squatting because I need to get my quads stronger to help my powerlifting squat. So you can use both depending on what you need them for at the time. 